Chase Claypool, wide receiver, 37 last year, 59 receptions, 105 targets, 860 yards, two touchdowns, 16.08% of the target share. Thoughts on Chase Claypool? If if they can get his red zone efficiencies up, I think this might be the guy you see take take a bit of a step up, right? Um, only two touchdowns for, for Chase Claypool is ridiculous. I mean, the guy stands head and shoulders above everybody else on the field. Obviously, he's a deep play threat at all times. Um, it, Roethlisberger just couldn't get it down the field, which is part of the problem that we had with Chase Claypool. So whether it is Mitch Trubitsky, Kenny Pickett, like both those guys have a better arm than what Roethlisberger did at the end of his career. You're getting a pretty good discount on Chase Claypool at this point as well. Not searching after him, right? But if I'm building my roster and he happens to fall into the right position where I can use him as whether it's a flex option or just a depth piece at wide receiver, that's more where I'm looking at Chase Claypool. I'm not looking at him as an option to start at wide receiver two on my roster um, or even wide receiver three, given a choice. I I agree with that. Again, you know, it's just, it's going to be tough because we just don't know what um, this, this team's identity is going to be. Obviously we know that Najee Harris is going to be, I think that, you know, they will use the run to set up the pass uh, to protect the quarterbacks, um, which means that, you know, few and far in between I shouldn't say few and far in between but but less less options for these receivers so I think again you know he should be better but that's too much of a risk for me actually I I think all the risk is pretty well taken out of it when you factor in his ADP coming off the board at like 110 that puts him in that kind of 11th to 12 uh yeah kind of that uh I'm sorry kind of in that 10th round type of range there for me and at a double digit pick I'll spend up on a guy that could go out there and win me a week, you know, come off the board wide receiver 41. You're probably drafting him at his floor there. Um, so yeah, I'll take a shot and I, I wouldn't have a problem necessarily drafting a chase Claypool. If I'm looking for wide receiver in the 10th round, 